Hello, hello. Hi, everybody. How are you? Welcome to our live. I wanted to talk today about three energetic shifts to see your profitability grow. Huge, huge welcome. How was your weekend? Let me know in the chat. Let me know if you're catching me live for the first time as well. If you are, very nice to meet you. And if you've been in our world for a while, then thank you so much for being here. And if you're on the replay, hello. Good to have you here with us. Do let us know that you caught the replay. You can use hashtag replay crew and then I can circle back and say hello to you. Ah, so excited to have this conversation with you. So who would love to see their profitability grow? Let me know in the comments who would love to hold more money. So this is for you if you are making a full time income from your business or you're wanting to. And this typically is about the 50K mark. And I wanted to speak to this because I know we've got many people that are wanting to go grow towards their six figure mark. And our community is shifting. We're holding this space for people who are growing their businesses at the six figure mark to the seven figure mark. So I wanted to speak to those of you who are wanting to grow to that next level so that we can get the needle moving for you. So you can stay with us in our community as all the training and the conversations that we're going to be having in the coming year are going to be really supportive to you where you are having that full time income in your business and growing to that next level. Does that all make all make sense? So let me know where you're at in the comments. I really want you to know that you can have this. You can feel to feel empowered by the truth of this reality so that you can make the, these energetic shifts and to see your profitability grow in your business. And then what I'm going to do at the end is I'm going to let you know how you can come and join me. So just to give you a bit of context, I wanted to talk about success overall, because so often in the online space, we can see people talking about success with just and the irony here is the group is the money kinesiology for um, for six and seven figure CEOs. But it is so much more than that, because for, for me, the money is a, a side effect of the impact. But so often we can see people just celebrating the, the financial side of things, but actually not having as much focus on everything. So to me, success comes from emotional intelligence to be able to navigate your business, to make informed, intentional decisions, to use your discernment to celebrate the financial success and to include how you feel about the whole of your life. The way we feel about our lives and our business is a huge indicator of success. And so for me, aligned success is it's, it's multidimensional. It, there's many aspects to it. It's multifaceted. And as we grow our businesses we get to experience all the good stuff and I know that for those of you who have been in business for a while you'll be like yeah this really speaks to me you know whether it's challenges with systems who's had that we implemented a new system earlier on this year during Mercury retrograde mm -mm, not good <laughs> um, so navigating your way through uh, challenges with systems challenges with 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 tech I should say it was, it was a challenge with tech that we were having as we implemented a new operating system operations team people and as we grow our businesses we our leadership consciousness is required to grow so that we can lead with all the good things compassion empathy to transcend any limitations that were that we we hold many of our previous experiences that we've created from our own experiences and as you grow your business, you face new challenges. And this, of course, then happens as a result of growing bigger. Different challenges come through and it could be to do with, you know, customer service, clients, team, team members. All the things. And along the way, of course, we will have triggers and questions that you just don't have the answers to. So for me, aligned success is that feeling that I have all aspects of the business growth aligned. Success is where everybody is winning, the, your, your customers or your clients, however you describe your, your uh, clients, customers, 
I use those terms interchangeably for, for people. So let me know, do you use the term customers or clients? Let me know in the comments. We want everybody to win. So your clients, your customers winning, your team members winning, the bottom line, profitability winning, and of course your personal life is it feeling aligned. You've got that balance and harmony across all areas. Does that resonate? I'd love to know what is success for you to have aligned success? What does that look like for you? Let's uh, see where you're at in the comments. And of course, if you're catching the replay, let me know what aligned success is for you. I'm just going to let Robin out. She's just come down. There you go. There you go. <laughs> what is success to you? What does having aligned success mean to you? So for me, there's three energetic shifts that you can make to have aligned success that are going to have a direct impact on your profitability and these shifts will activate your next level of leadership consciousness so the first one I wanted to talk about was standards and expectations so what I mean here is the standards that you acquire of yourself for your team for your associate coaches if you have associate coaches for your customer service essentially where can you require more of yourself in terms of the standards of operation that you expect for yourself and, and your business which leads me on to expectations because there's a there's a different energy between really wanting something to happen and then expecting it to happen without attachment expecting that your manifestation is inevitable so when you're approaching an offer a launch however you bring in sales in your in your business Take a moment to think, you know, what do you expect to do in sales when you're whatever it is that you're expecting is what you're an energetic match for. So what are you willing to expect and accept? What is what is normal to you? And can you expect an outcome without evidence? This is really where we're activating that faith, our relationship with the universe, knowing that you are the, the cause and not the effect. And then we have boundaries. So this will determine your energy levels, your magnetism and attraction that, so that you can pull people towards you. They can feel that energetic frequency of I know I'm supposed to be working with this, this person or to buy that person's product, whether you're selling, you know, I know we have many artists in here as well, musicians, whatever your business is, let me know in the comments what your services or your products are, are that you're offering your clients slash customers. That'd be great to know who's, who's tuning in. So that you often hear me talk about your energy doing the heavy lifting. So when your magnetism and attraction points are strong, they're held there by your boundaries. And when we feel safe, we can hold more energy. And so our capacity to hold larger groups is created by our boundaries. And this includes, your boundaries includes how you honour your personal boundaries. So by this, I mean, you know, time for yourself, your family, your self-care, the boundary of who you work with, focusing on working with your ideal clients and or customers. Does this resonate? If you were to do a little boundary audit, audit, where would it require a little bit of fine tuning? And then the third one that I wanted to talk about was responsibility. So the level of responsibility you're willing to take for your business is directly correlated with how much money you will hold, your profit margins. So I've got a couple of pointers for you can, so you can see what's going on. And I invite you to take a look at your relationship with res responsibility is if you, let's say you're in that space of, so let me know if this resonates with you, you know, like you can make huge amounts of cash in the business, but then it seems to be disappearing as fast as it comes in. There are a, a couple of things going on here and I dive into this deeply with clients in the, in the wealth portal. So the first thing is your nervous system is calibrated to scarcity and, and not having. And so it's gonna literally release the money as fast as it comes in. So it might show up, so if, if you, this is what's going on if you're recognizing this as manifesting unexpected bills or going on a spending splurge of things that you don't really desire, like silly spending. Your nervous system is feeling 
safer as it's just oh, let that money go as it's released the money. So it's brought itself back into alignment with what it's calibrated to. Does that make sense? The second thing that can be going on is your nervous system isn't calibrated to hold responsibility. So it spends money to make problems go away. And this can show up as hiring the wrong team members or hiring team members that you don't need because you're in an energy of abdicating responsibility rather than delegating or keeping team members on when your business models change around them or you're spending on projects that don't actually move the needle forward. Has anyone done that here? Recognize that. Ask me how I know. My relationship with responsibility really has, um, when I reflect back, so this is about my second year in business or my third year in my business when I remember being in the energy of, I just, I can't do sales calls anymore. They were just taking up so much time, 40 hours a month sometimes on sales calls, speaking to people that, you know, some of them weren't really ready to be having the conversation about sales. They were really in that space of, you know, um, I always talk about people being in the slow lane or the middle lane or the fast lane of where they recognize their issues are and whether they're ready to, to, to solve the problem and to work with you. And so some of those people weren't really in the fast lane. They were just like, oh, this would be nice to have a conversation with Louisa. And, and so it was taking up so much time. And I was like, I can't do this anymore. And it, the first thing I did was to hire a sales team. And this, this was at a huge expense. And I had the team for about six months and I tried different people. And when I look back, they brought in one new client during that time. And I'd been setting up systems to train them. I'd hired a sales coach to help me, you know, to coach them and all the things. And I know when I look back, I was energetically, I had this frequency of I just want someone to take this off me because I was burning out. Instead of delegating, there was this push energy, this abdication of responsibility. Does that does that resonate? Has anyone else been here in that space where you've recognized you thought you were delegating and then you're like, no, actually, if I think back, energetically I was abdicating responsibility I was pushing pushing it away and of course when we're in a push energy we, we create more push and we create more more resistance does that make sense now energetically I can hold more my boundaries have expanded I honor my time I expanded my consciousness I honor my clients for time as well I have conversations in direct messenger and email and I treasure the responsibilities. I've created a new system where we can honor, honor people's time, work in alignment with our boundaries and hold the responsibility. Does that make sense? So, so to be able to have the shift in your profitability in your business, the, the bit that really to, to share is it isn't always about redesigning your business model and then throwing everything out it is about having the alignment in in um your energy to have that aligned success it's about you know mastering the energetics and and of course being aligned in the strategy that you're implementing so with my sales a sales example i wasn't aligned in the strategy because i was in that push energy does that make sense and when you expand your leadership consciousness to include your standards, expectations, your boundaries and your relationship with, with responsibility, these energetic shifts will create a radical increase in your profitability. I'd love to hear what is landing for you. Any light bulbs that you are having in relation to this? Alrighty, and if you wanted to go deeper and you are ready to go deeper, then this is what we are doing. This is what we are up to. We have our coaching and mentoring programs for you. So we have two um, that we have the doors open for right now. So we have the Wealth Portal, which is for all entrepreneurs and CEOs. This is our four month program where you'll break through in 60 days or less and then be supported in transforming your relationships with responsibility, boundaries, mastering the energetics of your standards and expectations so that you are healing your money story and you're able to hold the up level so that you can continue to expand your wealth consciousness to hold the profitability as it comes in and to really master the art of reality creation. And then we have the Infinite Prosperity Collective, which is for coaches and healers and mentors who want to grow to multi six figures profitably sustainably 
so that you can make the difference that you came here to make. And that's our eight month spiritual business mastermind. So I'm just going to give you a quick overview here. So in the wealth portal, you'll get nine modules of training calls showing you the exact steps, and how to release the and transmute the energy of the, the blocks and the resistances and, and the trauma that has is being held in your consciousness that's creating that stickiness in what you're allowing in in your business success. So we're healing your relationship with money, changing your identity around money. And I guide you through it step by step with some specific things to do with our Helix Method manifesting process so that you have the, you know, the results that you desire. And we gather together three times a month for live calls so that you're fully supported. You know, you've got time to answer, have your questions answered, receive laser coaching on any of the niggles that are coming up and anywhere so that's any stickiness. And we do manifesting together and we do cash record activations together as well. So this is so, I just absolutely love it. And we have recently, I, I work on the themes that are coming up for the clients in, in the group. So this last month, we I guided the clients through a powerful way to uncover what was um, locking in their money default set point in alignment with their unique energetic blueprint. Also transmuting the energetics of, you know, their most valuable asset in business, which surprised people what it was. And we were guided by the Akashic Record Keepers. And we have our calls on uh, the first three Wednesdays, typically the first three Wednesdays of, of each month. And uh, we, we set out the schedule for, for everybody in the in the membership site. So if you're feeling drawn to the Wealth Portal, we'd love to have you with us. Right now, we do have a special invitation for you. So you can benefit from our 2022 savings and bonuses. We're reviewing our pricing for 2023. So just reach out to me now and let me know that you'd like all the details and we'll get the invitation over to you. I've got all the information in a Google Doc for you. So you can just have a read through and just let me know that you're in and we'll get you set up. And if you are a coach and you know you need to focus on your, your strategy and your offers and growing your audience and to know what to do when as you grow towards multi six figures, then the Infinite Prosperity Collective is for you. And this is our eight month mastermind and you'll get our roadmap to 250k plus uh, to a year plus and we'll guide you through it so I'll be walking by your side step by step as, along your path to your success so this includes the leadership and energetics coaching copy reviews so you get copy copy coaching and the business strategy so this is the this is the trifecta for your accelerated growth you need you need all of these aspects so if you haven't hit six figures or multi six figures yet, then do come, come and join us in IPC because this is your fastest path to success. You'll discover things you didn't didn't know that you needed to know. Um, and I'll be by your side to guide you on what to focus on when so you have your, your fastest path to success. And we have live calls as well um, three times a month. These are on Tuesdays at four o'clock UK time so that you're fully supported where you'll receive laser coaching on supporting you know you through implementing the methods in your business you can move through with ease because it's in the implementation that I always find all the questions bubble up for people as are they needing to fine tune and tweak things along the way and we also are guided by the Akashic Record Keepers and do Akashic Record activations together uh, once a month as well and we have a huge bonus for our IPC clients we promote you to our community so we invite you onto our podcast Right, you to our email list which is over 9,000 people so that's completely priceless and we really do truly have a, a beautiful mastermind group it's very high touch the group is small because you have unlimited copy reviews and so the spots are limited for IPC so if you've been thinking about IPC now is the time to to reach out and we've um, created some special options for you so that you can find the option that's most aligned for you so just reach out to me via Messenger and we can explore if this is a fit for you. And if I know that I can help you, then I'll pop over the details for you so you can have a read through and let me know that you're in and then we'll take it from there. Alrighty, so excited to find out what has landed for you with these three energetic shifts that you can make to see your profitability grow. Looking forward to seeing your comments and uh, for, thank you very much for everyone who's joined live or of course, indeed, if you've joined, uh, joining us for the replay, I will circle back and, and pick up your comments. Alrighty, sending you so much love, lots of love. Take care. Bye-bye.